Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel where we share lots of amazing tips on Kajabi and marketing and your online businesses. In this video, we're going to talk about getting started with Kajabi because sometimes when you get into Kajabi, it can seem a little daunting and overwhelming and we want to be able to make it as easy as possible so that you can get up and running and hit the ground, putting your, your program together so that you can get launched. So the first tip I have for you is use the Kajabi Assistant. Up here at the top of most of your menu pages will be the Kajabi Assistant. And if, for example, I'm wanting to find where the forms are, we just type in forms, and you'll see anything that jumps up for the most common things that have to do with forms. So here is a new opt-in form, a new form field, and so then you can pick what you want as well as help articles that have to do with forms. Now let's say we're looking for coupons. And again, it takes us right to the action that we're looking for so that we don't have to hunt and peck and spend all this time trying to figure out where we want to go. So use your Kajabi Assistant. It's super, super handy and will save you tons of time. The other key tip is to go into your settings and make sure that you've gone through all of these settings and set them up off of defaults and put them on what you want them to be for your site. Now, even if you've been using Kajabi for a while, you may not have done this. And I've seen even some of the big names in the industry and I go to their sites and I know they're using Kajabi, they have missed some of the settings in here. So one of the key ones to start with is your site details. And in here, we can adjust what you want your um, branding to be, including your favicon, which I believe is short for favorite icon, which essentially is your image that will show up in the address bar on a PC. The other huge one is your colors. The color palette is a really, really important one. And the handy thing about changing your color palette is that these are default color palette. And anytime that you're in any of your page builders or your website builder or your email editor and you pull up your default color palette, uh, to change your backgrounds and your your primary colors or your buttons, any of that stuff, the default palette is what is going to show there. So if you put your brand colors into this color palette, it will make it so much easier to do your editing. You won't miss or put the wrong colors. It'll help you keep your brand consistent. So this is a super huge one that I'm always sharing with all of my clients to make sure that you change this color palette, especially if you're working with a, a virtual assistant or something like that. It just makes it easier for them as well because then your colors are already in your settings and will show up. The other tip that I have for you today is to create a page template. So when you go to your page builder, as we create new pages, we want to be able to have a basic page template. That way then when you create, instead of a new page up here, you can just go to your page template, keep it in draft, go to these three dots over here and clone that page. What this does by creating your basic page template is that every time you create a page, you don't have to worry about um, the header, the footer, your default colors, your menu, your favicon, your fonts. Uh, all of those settings are already set up. It's gonna save you a ton of time and help you keep your brand consistent throughout all your pages. Now, obviously, if you don't want a menu on that particular page or you don't want the footer on that particular page, you can just go ahead and delete that or edit it as necessary or as desired. But by creating this page template, it's still going to save you a ton of time. Those, those are just a few quick tips to help you get started as you're getting into Kajabi. We hope you find that super helpful. So if you do, be sure to subscribe to the channel. We'll be posting Kajabi tips and lots of marketing things to help you out with your program, as well as visit my 
uh, website at striveforsavvy.com. And we also have a um, Kajabi mentorship program, with very comprehensive that'll walk you through all of these things like getting started and uh, at the checklist and the processes to be able to help you in building your Kajabi site. You can find that also on our website. So thanks for visiting and hope everything goes well with your Kajabi site, that you launch it to the world and make a difference.